This patient was referred to me for endodontic retreatment of tooth number eight. According to the patient, this tooth was traumatized, cracked, and a couple of years ago, uh, he saw his dentist and his dentist did a root canal and crowned the tooth. And a few, a couple of weeks ago, he noticed a little pimple on his gum. He called it a pimple on his gum and went and saw his dentist and his dentist told him, oh yeah, your tooth is abscessed. And uh, well, he was referred to me for evaluation of tooth number eight and possible endodontic retreatment. And uh, when we saw him, of course, uh, uh, noticed that uh, this tooth, tooth number eight, was actually a little bit longer than tooth number nine. It was it was protruded. Um, as you can see, previous root canal, fiber post looks like off center fiber post and a large peripheral lucency. And this is this is the tooth right here, and you can see there is a small labial parialis and sinus tract associated with tooth number number eight right there. All right, then here's the post op. So today we went through the porcelain crown and removed the fiber post, and uh, of course. Remove the old gutta percha using chloroform. Apical diameter turned out to be over 60. So I placed an MTA plug followed by gutta percha and sealer, temporized the tooth and referred the patient back to his dentist for the permanent restoration. Again, the good thing about MTA when you place an MTA is that MTA, of course, in larger diameter canals, seals much better, gives you a much better apical seal compared to gutta percha. The other thing is that Later on, if I ever need to do an apico on this tooth, my apico is, is, is so much easier, so much faster, because then all I need to do is, I don't need to retrofill. I just, I just resect the apical few millimeters of the root, clean all of this out, resect the apical few millimeters of the tooth, and I'm done. I don't need to retrofill with MTA or any other material. It's all, it's all done. So the apico would be a breeze, would be very quick. I do these in like, 20 minutes to half an hour all right so everything as you can see went well i'm optimistic hopefully the non-surgical retreatment will work otherwise if it if it doesn't work then we're ready to go to apical